Hey, what up, YouTube? Small little video here. A week ago, I got put out of service, and I had to call Roadside. Roadside charged me $210, and it's a small video showing y'all what my situation was, and I didn't know that the fuse for the trailer brake on these KWs and some peaks, older model peaks, older model KWs and freight line, the fuse is on the front firewall. So quick little video to show y'all, to keep y'all out of paying tickets and getting warnings with DOT. So if you ever go through this problem, if you ever had this problem, I'm gonna show you exactly how to fix it. Let me pop this other real quick. Uh, yeah, I hear you. Whew. You hear me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, here we go. So basically, it's on the left driver's side. If you have this situation and you go through a problem where your brake lights on the trailer don't work, the brake light fuse, let me clear real quick so I don't want to get this oil, this grease on my sweater. But if you had this problem right here, this right here is for your trailer brake, all right? There's a 30 fuse in there. So this is for your brake. So if your trailer brakes ever go out on your trailer and you have an older model truck, this is a 99. An older model truck like this, your trailer brake fuse is on a firewall outside. It's not on the fuse box. It's outside. So that will fix your problem right there. So let me try to move in a little bit so you can see what I'm talking about, all right? So it says right here, this is for your trailer brakes. So if you ever had a situation where your trailer brakes go out and DOT, before he call a roadside service, make sure you check this right here. So this right here would get you out of it. They charged me $210 for a roadside. And all he did was jump the wire on the back. And he screwed me. So I had to pay for him to MacGyver the truck. So right there, when you see that wire that's jumped at, the green one, he jumped that wire and it didn't need to be jumped. All you had to do was hit the fuse. You see how that green wire overlaps? Right there. So if you ever go through this situation, DOT, your trailer light's not working on an older model KWP or Freightliner. It's on the firewall, all right? Let me show you one more time. So I understand what I'm talking about. Right there, it's on the firewall. So what you're gonna be looking for is this fuse right here. All right, it's a 30 amp in there. So I hope that helps y'all with y'all problems out there with DOT. Take care, drive safe, and it's your boy DIY Trucker J. Make sure you like, share, subscribe to the channel. I'm out of here, all right? Peace. Take care, yourself.